Hey girl, did you know the small cockroaches you see in your kitchen don't grow up to be the big flying ones? Oh, okay, who are you and why are you telling me this? Because you look lovely and you need to know this. Oh, then tell me. Cockroaches are one of the most common pests found all over the world. However, few know about the different types of cockroaches and their origins. Cockroaches are members of the order Blattidia, whose name has been derived from the Latin word Blatta, which translates to insect that shuns the light. The name cockroach comes from the Spanish word for cockroach, cucaracha. There are more than 4,000 species of cockroaches, but only around 20 of them are classified as pests, out of which there are three main types the German, the American, and the Oriental. The most common among them is the German cockroaches. German cockroaches are relatively small, approximately 2 cm or 0.8 inches long. They are the ones found in your kitchen running around whenever you visit your kitchen at night. Though they are relatively tiny, they breed the fastest and you can find your roach population grow to a large size in a pretty short amount of time. They can crawl through pipes and ducts into your home and can infest and breed in a lot of places like sinks, cupboards and drawers. German cockroaches eat a variety of household items including book bindings, crumbs, soap and even toothpaste. They shed quite often and leave behind egg casings that can cause asthma attacks and trigger allergies. German cockroaches are dangerous in homes because they can spread diseases by contaminating food and cooking surfaces. They also breed within electrical devices such as your toasters, microwave and tend to damage circuit boards as their bodies are conductors of electricity and they tend to short these circuits. If you are scared of cockroaches, people will call you a pussy, but correct them. Tell them the word is Katsaridaphobia. It will make you sound classy. Classy? Now from the German cockroaches, we go to the next type. These are the Oriental cockroaches. Oriental cockroaches are relatively bigger at 2.5 cm or an inch long with the dark brown or black bodies. They look closer to a beetle than a cockroach. They are also called the water bug as they stay in damp areas. They move relatively slow but are among the most dangerous as they feed on garbage and feces and carry the most amount of bacteria. They also stink. They are usually found in damp and dark locations like under sinks, basements and sewers. They'll contaminate food, food preparation areas and utensils simply by walking over them. Luckily, their odor is strong enough to warn you that your food has been contaminated. And then finally, we have the American cockroaches. They are among the largest and the ickiest of cockroaches. They are reddish brown in color and can grow up to 5 cm or 2 inches in size. They are mostly found outdoors especially in drains and sewers. They enter houses mainly through sewer pipes or windows. However, unlike the oriental cockroaches, these guys are fast. They can move up to 5 km per hour. That would be around 40 body lengths per second, which would be comparable to a human running at 330 km per hour. You're too slow. What? American cockroaches prefer a diet of decaying organic matter, but will also eat just about anything, including crumbs, household scraps, leaves, food, algae, and even smaller insects. American cockroaches can occasionally fly, being the hero we need to save us from terrible TikTok videos. This cockroach is readily found in commercial and large buildings such as restaurants, grocery stores, bakeries, and any place where food is prepared and stored. So tell me, what did the German cockroach say to the American cockroach? Nothing. Cockroaches don't speak. What's wrong with you? The reason why the cockroaches are called Oriental, American and German are still unknown. Most of these species have said to be originated from Africa and the Middle East, but now they have spread all around the world. There are few other types of cockroaches which we didn't mention. They are the brown man, Asian, Australian and there are many more. They aren't the most important cause of a disease, but like houseflies, they may play a supplementary role in the spread of some diseases. They are proven or suspected carriers of organisms causing diarrhea, dysentery, cholera, dermatitis, typhoid. In addition, they carry eggs of parasitic worms and may cause allergic reactions. Cockroaches rarely bite, but when they do, they feel more like a bite from a bed bug, a little itchier than a mosquito bite. 
They are attracted to areas with more food remains like nails and mouth. Here are some methods of getting rid of cockroaches. Insecticides. These could be sprays or liquid gels. Boric acid. A homemade remedy is using boric acid, flour and sugar to make a dough. The flour and sugar will attract the roaches while the boric acid will kill them. However, don't use this method if you have pets. Cockroach traps. There are many different traps for cockroaches available in the market. Some with a maze structure with one-way doors and others with a sticky trap. If you find an infestation in your neighborhood, who are you going to call? Exterminators. Cockroaches are highly adaptable insects and develop a resistance to insecticides. Professional help can go a long way in eradicating these pests. Cockroaches can be prevented by maintaining a high level of cleanliness, cleaning food crumbs, clearing the garbage, cleaning grease on gas stoves, and doing a deep clean of your house every month will help. Doing this can get rid of factors that could have otherwise caused an attraction to these pests. Wow, I surely learned so much about cockroaches. You are a hell of a smooth talker. Do let us know in the comments what more you would like to know about. See you in the next one.